Harnessing the power of expert opinions and quotes in English discussions. Hello, learners. Welcome to another episode of our English language learning series. Today, we're diving into an interesting and significant part of preparing for debates and discussions, identifying expert opinions and quotes. By the end of this video, you'll be equipped with skills to enhance your arguments and effectively convey your points using expert opinions and quotes. So, let's get started. When it comes to English debates and discussions, expert opinions and quotes are invaluable tools. An expert opinion is an assertion made by someone recognized as a specialist in their field. This expertise makes their statements reliable and highly persuasive in a discussion. A quote, on the other hand, is a direct excerpt of someone's words, typically an expert's. Quotes can offer credibility, support your arguments, and give a fresh perspective to your point of view. Before using expert opinions, it's essential to know how to identify them. But how do you do that? First, pay attention to the source of the information. Experts usually have credentials like academic degrees or significant experience in the area they're speaking about. Secondly, look for published works or studies they might have conducted. These are often signs of expertise in a particular field. In debates and discussions, you may come across numerous statements. So, how do you select the ones worth quoting? Look for statements that are clear, succinct, and impactful. Remember, a good quote should be able to stand on its own and deliver a powerful message. It can also offer fresh insights, thereby enhancing the quality of your arguments. Once you've identified expert opinions and quotes, it's time to gather them. Make sure you understand the context in which they were made. Misrepresenting or taking quotes out of context can weaken your arguments. Also, remember to note the source of the information. It adds credibility to your points and shows respect for the original speaker's thoughts. Now that you have gathered expert opinions and quotes, the next step is to incorporate them into your discussions effectively. Remember to paraphrase expert opinions in your own words, maintaining the original meaning. This will show your understanding of the topic. For quotes, clearly attribute them to their authors and use quotation marks to indicate that you're quoting verbatim. And that's it for today's session. Remember, harnessing expert opinions and quotes effectively can greatly enrich your debates and discussions. It can help you persuade your audience, substantiate your points, and make your arguments more impactful. Keep practicing, and you'll soon become adept at identifying and utilizing these resources. We hope this video has been helpful, and as always, keep learning and improving your English skills. Until next time, goodbye and take care.